Junior guard Cameron Tyson has one sweet shot. He currently leads the Red Hawks in scoring. I need one, I get one. But he's not the only one from his family that can drain from long range. Uh, YMCA basketball game. Um, I had probably my, I think I made my first three ever. And that's when I was like, okay, I really like doing this. I was super happy smiling down the court. DeMarcus Tyson played for the University of Portland and is one of the school's all time best three point shooters. DeMarcus and Cameron were both coached by their dad, but Cameron was inspired by his big brother. So I seen all the places it took him, and I was like, I want to follow in his footsteps. That's my big brother. And uh, not only following his footsteps, but I, you know, I want to be better than he was. Separated only by four years, DeMarcus and Cameron built a bond through basketball. We'd play one-on-one, -on -one, he'd lose, he'd want to play again, he'd want to play again until he would be so frustrated that he can't play anymore. And I think... I think that's why he's so, the way he is now, like he's the ultimate competitor. He'll never back down, he'll never give up. I got frustrated, I ain't gonna say I cried, but I, <laughs> I was definitely frustrated. There was tears shed, there was tears shed, but, <laughs> but uh, he never quit, he never did quit. He would, uh, he'd keep wanting to play, he'd keep wanting to play, and I mean, he'd do anything to win. And when Cameron was a senior in high school, he finally did win. I got the ball first, threw it my first shot, felt good, boom, made it. <laughs> And then uh, I think I might have traveled around with the ball, but he teched up. I just ran to the rim, quick layup. And then I shot another three and made it. And then I see I was talking trash the whole rest of the day. I'll never forget three that. Three nothing, it's over. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Quick one. He didn't have, it just hit you like that, huh? It was the worst loss I've ever taken. My heart sank. But DeMarcus admits now his heart was actually full. His little brother had become a star. Cameron broke Zach Levine's all-time scoring record at Bothell. In 2021, he made the Final Four with Houston, but then transferred to Seattle U to be closer to family. That same year, DeMarcus decided to end his professional career in Europe and become a coach. He took a job as an assistant at Seattle U, and the two brothers would be reunited. It's very special. I mean, not a, not a lot of people have the opportunity to, you know, to play for you know, somebody in their family, and let alone their brother, and especially at this level. Um, so just every day, you know he has your best interests at heart and you know he loves you at the end of the day. So when it's in between these lines, he, he's my coach. But as soon as we leave, like leave the, leave the gym, he turns into my brother. Yeah, I mean, when I see him out there and he's, you know, goes on his little run where he scores 12 straight or 14 straight, it's hard not to be really happy for him. In Seattle, Chris Egan, King 5 Sports.